Relay for Life kicked off today in Houghton. It's the most successful fundraiser in the UP when it comes to raising money for cancer research. Fox UP's Gabriella DeLuca went to Houghton High School today where supporters lined up for the big event. And it's a great day. 30 teams, about 150 survivors, and one common goal, beating cancer. Relay for Life participants are stationed at Houghton High School football field for the next 24 hours, where they'll walk to support cancer research. You know, you get into your normal life and your normal routine, and you think about things, and then you come to something like this, and it really kind of humbles you again and, and puts you back to that place that you were when you dealt with it long ago. And, you know, and you get to see people that are currently dealing with it and just kind of kind of gives you a piece of humble pie. Best relay in the state of Michigan. So far, the Copper Country Relay has raised $70,000 and they have a goal of $100,000 with all proceeds going straight to the American Cancer Society. Cancer deaths are declining each and every year because of events like Relay for Life, but we're not there yet. That's why we got to keep on relaying, continue the fight to fight cancer, and hopefully one day there won't be a relay because there will be a cure, but we're not there yet, so everybody comes out and this is a celebration of life. Throughout the day, people lit luminarias for loved ones who lost their battle with the disease. And tonight, those lights will line the track for the nighttime walkers. Each year, survivors make their mark by imprinting their handprints, symbolizing that they have beat the disease. Now, in years past, there's been almost 150 survivors at the relay. It's, a, it's on a global level, really. It's not just national and local. It, it hits all across the whole world, the uh, people dealing with this, this same issue and, and trying to figure out how are we going to cure it. Gabriela DeLuca, Fox UP News, Houghton.